Hello humans! It is day 94, I believe, and today I'm wearing my boba shit first. My, my boba shit first. My boba fet shirt. As you may recall, about a week or so ago, I got rid of Darth Vader and Master Windu. Well, time has finally come to say bye-bye to this fella. As the same guy who bought Darth Vader has uh, taken, a, taken a bit of a liking to, to little Boba here. So it's uh, it's bye bye to you. Oh dear, what's that? Just a bit of fluff. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. So thank you, Mr. Withers. If you do ever see this, let's face it, you're not going to see this because you've got far more interesting things to do with your life, probably, than look at this. But yes, thank you and goodbye. We had some we had some times, didn't we? You sat on a shelf staring down at me. Me really not caring too much about your existence. So he's going off to a better, happier home now, which is all good. Speaking of home, though, I've been looking at the new Weir Crossing recently. And by recently, I mean it's, it's still right there on my screen. Um, and there's nothing like looking at the construction of a new bridge over a bloody river. To really make you miss the part of the country that you originally spawned from. And for some reason, I don't know why, but seeing this new fucking bridge, I might put a picture on screen for you if I can be bothered, um, but seeing this new bridge, which looks quite snazzy, really, it does look quite nice, so far anyway. Um, it's just making me really want to go back to Sunderland, which is something that I never thought I'd actually see. Um, Newcastle. Newcastle's fantastic. I love Newcastle. Newcastle's a lovely place. But Sunderland, I, okay, they've tried, they've tried to uh, rejuvenate the place a bit over the last few years. But it, it's still a shithole, isn't it? I mean, come on. It's still, there's no there, man. There's fuck all a D in Sunderland. Apart from going to Newcastle, going to the Metro Centre, something like that. Or even going to fucking Durham. But Sunderland, what we got? We've got the National Glass Centre. We've got, we've got, uh, we've got Roker. We've got Roker. Uh, we've got Roker Beach and everything like that. So the, the seafront's quite nice, but if you want a nice seafront, you want to go up the fucking uh, Colour Courts, Tynemouth or South Shields, really, don't you? It, hell, even, even Blythe is not too bad. Uh, but you do have, there's a, there's a nice chippy on Roga Beach, so there is a nice chippy down there. Um, we do have the Empire, we have the Empire, which is the only theatre in the North East that's capable of hosting West End Shores. So that's not too bad, that's something that you kind of get in Newcastle. Um, hey, it's alright, it's alright. The time I did take Andy to Newcastle, um... We spent a bit of a day in Sunderland, but we didn't really do much. It was mostly down the freaking beach, really. Um, so I wouldn't mind going back, because there are a few things that are different now. Like the, um, I think it's called Keel Square. It's where the law courts are and everything like that. So they've put in freaking fountains and benches and stuff like that. You don't want fountains and benches in the city centre of Sunderland. The wind gets up, you'll be freaking coloured. Well, you're covered in freaking rain most of the time now anyway, really, aren't you? Um, oh god, that reminds me of the time we, what was it, we'd just gone to the cinema, uh, the Empire Cinema, and that's really fit and confusing. You got the Empire Theatre, then you got the Empire Cinema. Hey man, what the fit you're playing at? I didn't think of these things. So we got to the Empire, I what we're going to see. Oh, we're going to see that. Oh, I thought you meant the fucking cinema, man. No, the theatre, oh, I didn't want to fucking sit around watching that. But, anyway. I, what was I on about? Yes, we went to the cinema, not me and Andy, this is years ago. We went to the cinema and it was snowing a little bit and then we'd come out. We'd fucking come out of the cinema. It was fucking oh, halfway up your leg. It's fantastic. You didn't get snow like that around here in bloody Sheffield, I tell you. I don't know what I'm talking about now and I feel as though my accent's maybe slipping out a bit. So no one's going to understand a fucking word I'm saying today. 
Oh god, I've got to go to the post office yet. How the hell am I gonna get into a post office talking to a fucking broad Sheffield last scan? You know, alright, love, can I have a fucking box for me? Fucking Boba Fett here. I need to send him off to London or somewhere like that. I don't know. I've fucking forgotten the postage address now. That's somewhere else. Last time I fucking posted Darth Vader. Last fucking time I posted him and Mace Windu off. Got these lovely fucking labels all ready to go, ready to just stick on the boxes off the go. Lovely, see you later, thank you for the money very much, you know. Fucking left them here, didn't I? Fucking left the bloody stickers here, just lying around on the fucking sofa right next to where I was sat. There come home, I was like, oh for god's sake, where the bloody hell are they? I was looking through me bag, the cellar tape, the scissors flying all over the place, nearly took the eye out of a fucking old lady in the back crowd, man. And there's a, that's, there was no bloody stuff here at all. I managed to scrounge a pen off the last behind the counter and scribbled on the boxes that I think that's the fucking thing. It turned up, it turned up, I don't know about fucking Mace Windu, but I posted it and I got the money, so I don't fucking care. Um, what is your... Uh, I just... I just uh, cannot even think now. But, gotta look after your sticky labels. That's the moral of today's story. Look after your sticky labels, and everything will be fine. I'm going down the shops now, post this fellow away, and I might get a Greg sausage roll on the way. Thank you for your time, and I'll see you in the future.